What's up bitches? My name is Miss Fortunate and today I'm going to be completely honest with you. I have not been in the mood to just record and you know make videos. I've just been totally out of it for the past couple weeks. I didn't upload a video last week and um, that is because uh, earlier I went to the Crescent Hotel in Arkansas and we stayed there over the weekend me and some friends and I made I was recording this really awesome video that has all these pictures and cool things and I am uh, still editing that. I thought I would be able to get it done by the time Tuesday came and I was sadly mistaken. So I wasn't able to get that done so I didn't have any video for that day and I just didn't want to record anything. It just I was, I was just out of it, out of motivation, out of everything, but that video is coming soon, I promise. It is a pretty long one, but I think it's pretty great. It has some cool things from the hotel, and it also has all of the, um, <clears throat> like the drive down there with all my friends, they're all awesome, we're all having fun and whatever. I think it's fun to watch. Maybe that's just me. Um, I hope that you'll stick around to watch it. I, I think it's pretty great, so I hope you guys will think so too. Anyway, my apologies, but today I'm going to be watching the Phantom the Horror trailer from Editing is Everything. Uh, I recently found this channel because of one of uh, their videos. I can't remember which one it was, but um, oh look, actually, hold on. Okay, so I couldn't find exactly which video it was, but it was the one that had, um, you know, Markiplier and Jacksepticeye and PewDiePie, and it was a horror trailer for that, and it was that one movie that came out, the horror movie, that was like, um, The Link, and like, they had this group chat call or something, and um, they all one by one started dying and whatever. It was that one, and I thought that was so cool. And um, since this is kind of a channel where they take, you know, um, other movies and uh, YouTubers and all that stuff, and she kind of edits it in such a way that it looks like an actual trailer for like a movie, except, you know, it's not, and she takes other people's stuff and turns it into her own thing, and I think that is amazing. I think, I mean, I'm in love with this channel because, I mean, from a fangirl point of view, it is like all these things that I'm interested in, um, like this Dan and Phil thing, and with all the YouTubers, I've seen some from movies that I enjoy, and that kind of stuff, so I really like seeing what she did with that, and kind of bringing, um, like, ideas and putting them into something new and creative, and I really love that. And also from, like, an editing standpoint, I am, editing is my baby. <laughs> It is my very expensive hobby, and like I fangirl so much over editing sometimes, like watching movies like Lights Out, um, the one scene whenever, I'm not going to give any spoilers, but there was a gun involved, and like every time it shot, like it would light up, and um, the monster who was, you know, in the darkness would like appear and disappear with every gunshot, and I thought that was so cool, and I like fangirled over it for like 10 minutes, and it was like... That was so cool! That was so amazing how they did that! Oh my god! And so, I just, the, her entire channel, like, great job! Like, oh my god, like, from an editing person's viewpoint, it's like, she did a really good job, and it's like, I can kind of tell how much work goes into these, and it's like, ridiculous. Like, I can only dream of being that good, <laughs> so, um, anyway, uh, I was going to watch this just in my own time, except whenever I pulled up the video, it says pause. Pause the video and please record your reaction and upload it to YouTube or Twitter and tag her. And so I decided, you know what, why not? We'll, we'll, we'll go with it. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So let's get into it. I'm excited. <laughs> <laughs> I like this. <laughs> I love that. I love that. That's funny. That's a lot of requests. <laughs> Hmm, I like that. That's cool.
Ooh, this is from Lights Out. I think. Hey Dan, have you seen the... Yeah, I think my flatmate's going insane. <laughs> I really love like the music and the cool creepy font. <laughs> mm. 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 It looks like these were filmed specifically for this trailer. I love how she like took all the stuff and brought it together. Who the fuck is this? I want answers. What are all these dead bodies doing here? I've already <laughs> seen the dead body. You can't distract me. I love that. <laughs> um, I love that. That was really cool. Okay, I don't even know what to say right now. It's like all of the clips that she took from all the different videos and stuff, which I, I mean, I laughed because like I recognized some of them from the videos and I was like, <laughs> I know what that's from. I get it. But then like she took them and put them together in such a way, it seemed like they were filmed specifically for this and that's cool <laughs> like if you had no idea that these people were youtubers or th or that this wasn't you know taken from several several different videos or I, i'm sure that you would think that she just kind of went and like filmed it you know just it seems really professional and it looks really cool it's, it, I, I'm just like at a loss. <laughs> From like a fangirl point of view, I think that was amazing. I, I love I love the thought of like dark YouTubers. Like I'm all into the dark applier and antiseptic eye and stuff. I made an AMV that was like dark antiseptic eye or septiplier or something like that. And um, I'll link that in the description if you're interested. So like it's really cool seeing something like that that like looks legit and it's so professionally done and it's like, it's so cool, because it has its own, you know, story that kind of puts it all together and takes all the people that I think I know and turns them, you know, into bad guys. And I, th I think that's really cool. And then, from an editor's standpoint, it's like, I loved, like, how all of the, um, the saturation was brought down and it was all, you know, dulled colors, like a lot of black and white all that stuff. I really love the creepy music in the background and just the whole dark vibe that was with it. I think that's really cool. That's kind of um, something that I really enjoy, you know, seeing, creating, all that stuff. It's, it's, it's creepy. I love creepy things. I really like what she did with the, the fonts and all that stuff. Like, it was just a really simple white font with black background that just kind of faded in, faded out, faded in, faded out. It just did, I thought that was really cool too. Just everything about it I thought was awesome. I don't know, considering how she did this, like bringing a bunch of different stuff from different stuff and, you know, putting it into something that looked a lot like a trailer, I think she did a really good job. Of course, it's not, you know, perfect like an actual movie trailer. It's like, you don't have, um, like, dialogue context, how they don't really say stuff that would go along exactly with what story it could be, so it kind of, I don't know, I was a bit confused with, um, like, the story bit, I don't know, but then again, it's still, like, she didn't actually film this, so there's no way that you can get that dialogue context or whatever, and so I think she did a really good job with, like, um, 
considering the circumstances. So, um, I really like that. I really like that. I really, really, really love this channel. Oh my god, I just... Reflexes. <laughs> like, I only recently found this channel. I've only seen, like, a few videos of hers, but I love them either way. Like, I love just, you know, like, how she brings everything and does everything, and it's just so cool. Anyway, that's my reaction to... What is this? The Phantom Horror Trailer with Dan and Phil Pie. Editing is everything. Of course, I'm going to put the link to this video in the description so that you can go watch it for yourself if you wanted to, you know, react to it like I did. That'd be cool, of course. Tag her in it and tag me in it so that I can see it too. Um, that'd be cool. And then from that video, you can check out the rest of her channel, which would be really cool because, I mean, I really like what she's doing and I hope she, you know, continues to make all these things and, you know, gets bigger and that would be super cool for her to do because, you know, editors don't get enough credit as they should. Um, I mean, no one ever, you know, watches Jacksepticeye or Markiplier's videos and thinks, oh man, that's a really good editing job. No, very few people tend to do that. I know I didn't whenever, like, I wasn't editing or anything. I never thought about that. So. Um, I think her channel kind of shows like, hey, these people, they do a real good job sometimes, you know? So, um, if you want to go and support her channel, that'd be cool. You should do that. Support her with me. Anyway, that's all that I have for this video. Again, I'm sorry that I, you know, didn't upload last week. Real sorry about that. I'll, I'll work on it and hopefully this video will kind of make up for it. And then my Crescent Hotel video, which will come out soon, I hope that will make up for it as well. It's going to be an extra long video, so um, hopefully you enjoy it. And if not, I'm sorry. I'm sorry I failed you. I failed you. Anywho, that's all for me. I hope you guys are having a great month, a great year, a great week, a great life. Life. Mm. Thanks so much for watching. Peace out, bitches. I know that the video is over, and I just had like um this really you know happy persona, but um I just wanted to let you guys know that I lost um, something very important to me recently, and um, I had this flower, and it's dying. <laughs>